Hello friends, welcome to my channel again. In this video, we are going to learn some basic concepts of engineering drawing. Now, what is basically engineering drawing? Engineering drawing. Engineer is a creator. A man who puts his imagination into actual practice and problem in his mind to convey to other with the help of systematic lines and some points. This is a basic definition of engineering drawing. Engineering drawing का ये मतलब होता है कि अगर कोई बंदा अपने imagination को lines और points के द्वारा कागज पे बना दे तो उस चीज को हम engineering drawing कहते हैं आइए आज हम इस वीडियो में सीखेंगे कि engineering drawing के लिए basic चीजें क्या क्या लगती हैं एक पेंसिल तो लगेगी ही लगेगी बनाने के लिए एक इरेजर गलती हो गई तो उसे मिटाने के लिए और एक मिनी ड्राफ्टर ये है एक मिनी ड्राफ्टर इसमें जो है ये स्केल दी हुई है और ये स्केल दी हुई है दिस स्केल दिस स्केल इज यूज्ड फॉर मेकिंग परपेंडिकुलर लाइंस टू दिस वन दैट इज दिस स्केल एंड दिस स्केल are mutually perpendicular to each other and we have a protractor mentioned in it or you can say attached to it so we can rotate this scale to the angle which we want out here as you can see so if possible please look at this carefully can you see degrees mentioned out here these are the degrees for which we can rotate the scale at which we want this is 30 degree please look at this carefully i'm sorry for the light problems this mark this mark out here should coincide with the mark on this uh, uh, protractor then only the angle will be perfect please note that the protractor should have minimum error as minimum as possible this would give you an accurate diagram or the sketches which we will draw out here so the protractor is set on zero degree we will learn some basic lines which we are going to use in engineering drawing so i'm making my first line this line this line is also called as or it is only called as continuous thick line. This line is used for visible outline that is the main diagram or the main sketch we are gonna use will be shown by this line. Continuous thick. For some projections we will use this line. Is it visible to you all? The, I have made a long line out here. It's very thin and it should be thin. And it is continuous thin. This line is basically used for projections. Uh, orthographic projections and isometric drawings वगैरह वगैरह that we learn in the future this line the next line will be I'll make it out here so that you won't have light problems this line is called as dashed line it is also called as hidden line as the name suggests hidden line it is also used it is only used to make hidden objects like suppose a rectangle is hidden within a square so then we will use this line to mention that rectangle which is hidden in the square Now suppose we want to make a center line, so we'll donate, uh, denote a center, uh, center line with this one. 
chain thick please look at the way I'm drawing it line dot line dot line dot line this will be the method to draw a center line thin way or the short break line we call it as this free line so we can draw it anyhow like this it's used as an application for short break lines zigzag line I'm sorry for the pause. The zigzag line is made something like this. Something like this. And this is used for long break line. These are the six lines and the seventh and the last line which we will use for engineering drawing is chain thin line which I should have explained you out here itself chain thin chain thin is a line a smaller line dot a line a smaller line dot a line a smaller line dot a line this is the way which by which we make chain thin line and this is used for mentioning or marking cutting plane line suppose a cube is being cut perpendicular per perpendicularly so then we'll mention it mention the cut by this line thank you friends and i'm sorry for the light problems Thank you. Please like, please watch and please subscribe my channel. Thank you.